<clears throat> hey, is it okay if I go up into the main headquarters now? I'm sorry, little boy, but there just aren't any school tours today. What? I'm an intern. Agent Forsyth gave me this. Really? Let's check your head in the thinker print reader, please. Well, I'll be doused. Welcome to the intern program. Let me get you your orientation materials. Wow! That picture really captures my... startled side. Ooh, looks like I can choose where to focus my energy and upgrade my powers. Very interesting. Keep track of all the places I've been here. Aha! Maps are always useful. I'll keep my to-do list here. Scanning for thinker print. Granted. I'm really here! Psychonauts Headquarters! Ow! Sorry, new ball. Wow! Can I do anything to help, Lily? Yeah! Keep me from killing Jared here! I know too many of his weak points. I'm sure they'll let you up soon. I need to get up there right now so I can start Dad's psych herb therapy. Well, I better get to intern orientation. You'll like Hollis, I think. She's strict, but deep down, she's really serious. Okay. I'm sorry, Mr. Nono. He's with the medical team. And they said no visitors? I'm not a visitor. I practically grew up in this building, Jared. Look, Lily, I'm sure you'll be able to see him soon. I want to see my father. I'll let you know as soon as you can.
got some new gadgets available Scan in my it. shop for Attention testing. Uh, I mean for purchase. They're totally... Open up! I need some fresh air! What am I? A prisoner? No, you're an intern. What's the difference? You're getting school credit. <laughs> Greetings, fellow psychic. I'm Otto Mentalis. Uh, I'm personally too busy. Have a look around. Great idea. Let's make a side challenge marker and get you ranked up. Out of a sticky situation. So much cool stuff in there. I'll come back later for the rest of it. You gonna order anything? Nah. I'm holding out for the bacon. You are a honey pepper food. I've already forgotten. Come up to my office immediately. Before I forget why I let you into the intern room. Hey, look out! Oh, sorry, I didn't... Whoa! Ow! That's mean! Did he hurt you, baby? I'm not a baby. Yeah, you are. Question is, who's this new kid? My name is Raz, and I'm the new intern. That's ridiculous. I didn't ask for a new intern. Intern program's full. Sorry, kid. He is clumsy. He'd probably get us all killed. And he's mean. Well, kid, we give it a fair shot, and it looks like it just didn't work out. Better luck next year. Guys, quit picking on the new kid. We were all new ones, in case you forgot. I think he'll fit in just fine. In fact, I think he'll look cute in our uniform. Let's take him to the closet. Hey, you okay in there, Rusty? What's the holdup? It's Raz. I was just wondering, if there's an intern uniform, how come you guys aren't wearing it? Oh, well, we're level two. Now just hand out your clothes and we'll get you that uniform. Well, can't you hand me the uniform first? <laughs> no, silly. We need to take your clothes and measure them so we can get you a uniform that fits. Unless you want us to come in there and measure you. No, no. Here you go. Just hurry up, okay? It's cold in here and I'm practically naked. Uh-oh. Guys? Oh, come on! This is embarrassing in so many ways. There's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through it. Hmm. There's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through it. I don't have a key. to that supply chest I found. I don't know the code. Rats! Oh, sorry, Harold. You're absolutely right. 
I should think about how I'm using that word. What is it, Harold? Do you know the code? Is the code in there, Harold? I'm too big to go in there. If only I could see what you see in there. Hey, that reminds me. Almost had it. Time to see the world as you see it, Harold. Aha! That's it, Harold. We got him right where we want him. Yet we still can't extract the information we need. Have you tried the Corpus Colossorator? Sasha, you have to let me do more. You know it's because of me that... Otto. I mean, if I hadn't... Not a word, Rasputin, until I find you some new clothes. Sorry if the fit is a little off. They're the smallest clothes I had. Now, uh, tell us again how you ended up outside in your underwear. Oh, you know, I, I was sort of going undercover. Just like you did, Agent Mentalis, in True Psychic Tales number 62, when you used your defibrillator to hypnotize 16 trans troopers at once. Oh, please, that old yarn. Oh, they embellished so many details in that version. But in fact, it was 17 troopers. Well, love to chat, but uh, I gotta make like a brain and bounce. If you're ever looking for just the right tool for the job, come see me in my workshop. Even the best psychonauts require a little assistance now and then. Now, if you'll excuse me, Rasputin, I need to get back to the matter at hand. No, no. I didn't bend the spoons, Mommy. Ooh, I love going through the car wash. Oh, and don't worry about the other interns, Rescue. Initiation rituals are a common method for a specialized social group to integrate foreign elements while preserving the social exclusivity of that Understand? Hmm. I need more pins. I need all the pins. Uh, thanks, Sasha. Just cooperate with our investigation. That was a dirty trick you pulled. I want my clothes back. You know, you're right. I'm sorry. And I'm going to make it up to you. I'm going to let you finish my asset recovery mission. Why do I feel like I'm going to end up naked in a closet again? My intern assignment is to track down this list of missing Psychonaut assets. Mission critical assets. So, like a scavenger hunt? If you think like a child, you will do a child's work. Finish this mission, 
and we'll know you're ready for your clothes back. This looks like a good place to track my side missions. I'm really late to intern orientation now. I better get to the class right away. Agent 33, please report to Agent Forsyth's office. Experts agree, it's just not safe to use clairvoyance without my special clairvoyance enhancing pins. Cut! What do you mean, my psycho mech bat? Get a hold of yourself, Oleander. Gonna look fighting Maligula without my battle bot, cheapskates. <laughs> hey, I'm with you. <laughs> Letting him build a battle anything is probably a bad idea. Oh, right, new intern. Thought I told you not to be late. Doesn't matter. You need a mentor. Let me see who's left. Ooh, am I helping Mia or Sasha on a mission? No, you're in the mailroom. Your mentor is Nick John Smith. Mailroom? Nick John Smith? I've never heard of an agent John Smith. Nick's not an agent. He's not even psychic. He's just good at sorting mail. You'll love Nick. Everybody does. But... the mail room? Ford Crawler himself worked in that mail room. You could learn a lot there. For one thing, how to be on time. Okay, I've given you thinkerprint access to the mail room. Now scoot, I've got a base to run and a budget to balance. How's your dad? Terrible! I gotta go get him some therapy plant stats. How'd you get that hatch open? Oh, it's got a fingerprint combination. I can teach it to you. Come here. It's more than just a number. You kinda have to feel it. Do you feel it? Yes. Good. anybody you got it from me and you're dead bye to Agent Forsyth's office. Scanning for thinker print. Access granted. <gasps> Mr. John Smith? Hello? New intern here. Nick, let it get like this. 
everything okay in here? Who are you? I'm, uh, Nick John Smith's new intern. Oh, so you're the one not sorting all this mail. Wait! Better get all this mail sorted, quick! You're making Nick look bad. is addressed to Truman Zanotto. Hey, this might be important. I'd better bring it to Truman. Technically, this is official Psychonauts business. Heavy. What the heck did Truman order here? I'd better deliver this to Truman quick. I'd better deliver this to Truman quick. Oop! You guys gotta check this out. The new kid killed Nick. He's alive, but he's brainless. <gasps> what kind of sick monster would steal Nick's brain? I mean, Nick! Maybe he saw something he shouldn't have. But why keep his body alive? And why mail it to the Grand Head of the Psychonauts? It could be a warning. Hey guys, does the Lady Lucktopus Casino mean anything to you? Isn't that where we sent Agent 33? To investigate suspected delusionist activity? Agent 33 is two days late with her status update. I'll get the jet. I'll pack the go case. I'll stay here and protect the children. What? Aren't we all going on the mission? We could use you in tactical command, Agent Forsyth. And maybe the interns would benefit from... It's not safe. Not while we have a double agent among us. I'll take her place. I've heard the buffet there is shockingly reasonable. Well, if you reconsider, meet us on the jet pad within the hour. Can't we just... No, all of you. To the intern's bay. Now! 
I've got some training exercises planned today that are both informative and safe. Last one there has to delouse the brain tumbler. TV? I'll bet those guys took Nick's body back to the middle. Found. I should go check and see if he's okay. All hard. <sighs> he is my mentor after all. Just thinking about Please Nick. Please come to class. Yeah? Oh, that's right. Oh, good. You're finally here. Let me know when you're prepared to learn something. Don't wait too long. You'll miss class. Quato. I'll take that card. <gasps> Just how behind do you want to get? Almost had it. I just need to focus a little longer with You're already on thin ice with me, intern. Don't push it. When does class start? As soon as you get to my classroom. This isn't your classroom? No. This is. So are you ready, kid? Yeah. And what are you ready for? Safety. Oh, you think the human mind is safe? Well, that's cute. is how you perform the advanced psychic ability known as Mental Connection. Cool! Ooh, sorry. Could you repeat that? Sorry, kid. I warned you not to be late. I'm off to attend to some fiduciary concerns. Norma, take over for me, won't you? You can practice with some of those loose ideas. But Agent Forsyth, 
Is it safe to leave all these thoughts out like this if you're not here? Norma, please. It takes more than a few rambunctious children to affect the mind of a trained psychonaut. Try not to fall asleep in my class. All right, Rapscallion. Okay, now how do I explain mental connection extremely simply? Let me guess. We focus on an idea in someone's mind until we form a tangible connection with it. Oh, I didn't realize you were a mental connection expert. By all means, give us a demo. Professor. What the heck did you just do? I said connect with the idea, not jump inside it like a hamster ball. Sorry, old habit from the circus, I guess. Not only is cilantro delicious, it's affordable and easy to grow in a window box herb garden. What the heck is that? What? You left a slime trail. It's like he connected the two thoughts together! Oh, now you're in trouble. Hey, what's the big idea? Looks like... disgust. Well, I'm sure it's not the first time Rasputin has created that thought in someone's mind. Is he supposed? I know cilantro reduces the risk of digestive distress, but it tastes like soap. And honestly, I'd rather have the gas. Hey, Raz. If you can change Forsyth's opinion of cilantro, maybe you could change her mind about the casino mission. Hmm. I don't know about that. Yeah, I mean, she worries about us kids too much. It's taking years off of her life expectancy. Hmm. If you could get her not to be so worried all the time, we could all go on a real Psychonauts mission! Well, I don't suppose it would hurt to take a look around up there. Just see if there's any, you know, problems. To the top, Braz. Of course, if you're scared, don't do it. I mean, you'll probably well, get kicked out of the Psychonauts for trying, but what the heck? I like those. Connect those thoughts, young man. Try not to kill her brain, Braz. Remember, it's for the good of the mission. You're scared. Don't do it. I mean, you'll probably get kicked out of the Psychonauts for trying, but what the heck? Connect those thoughts, young man! Try not to kill her brain, Raz! Remember, it's for the good of the mission. Straight to the top, Raz! Of course, if you're scared, don't do it. I mean, you'll probably get kicked out of the Psychonauts for trying, but what the heck? Connect those thoughts! Oh, wait! This was a terrible idea! These poor.
they just don't have the experience. I'll just have to get Sasha to give up half of his laboratory budget. It was hard enough getting him to give up wearing socks with sandals, but you did it, Forsyth. Remember that. <sighs> Need to cut out the frills in the cafeteria for sure. No more imported truffles, Otto. Regular mushrooms are just as good. I can already hear Mia complaining she can't meditate without fresh cilantro in her chimichurri. That stuff tastes like soap, Fidelo. And also, we can't afford it. Oh. If I let them go to that casino, that's it. They'd be dead. I'm not letting another agent get hurt on my watch. I need to keep them safe. I don't want her to know I'm here. How can I keep anyone safe? How can I find this mole? Our Lady of Restraint Neurological Hospital. I think Hollis said she was an intern here once. I always had my best ideas here. Let's just hope I don't run into Dr. Putz. Maybe trying to change her mind is a bad idea. No, wait. I think that is a bad idea. any bad ideas but my own. Speaking of, I gotta catch up to Hollis and try to change her mind about the mission. <laughs> There's the mental energy I needed. Thanks, Psypop. What's that sound? Oh my god, look at the size of that kid's head! Get him to radiology, stat! You saved another life, Dr. Potts. Oh, please, I was just doing my job. I heard the technique you used was developed by your intern, Hollis Forsyth. Oh, uh, my intern? <laughs> yes, yes, well, we did collaborate on that a little. The patient will make a full recovery, Dr. Potts. All thanks to you. Mm-hmm. And your brilliant intern, Hollis Forsyth. Why, uh, yes. Well, she has been a helpful assistant. I like the look of these. This brain has made amazing progress. Another life saved by the Forsyth method. The, the POTS method? POTS? It was my invention? That in turn merely transcribed my dictation. Oh, uh, my apologies, Dr. POTS. In fact, I was thinking of getting rid of her. Huh. I've got half a mind to look for the other half. Something tells me it's not too far away. I can't believe something. Ah, 
Good luck collecting your debts after I'm dead, losers. Good luck collecting your debts after I'm dead, losers. Mm. At our current burn rate. Uh, that's no good. Maybe if I move some funds around. I could postpone paying those bills, but not these. I went to school for medicine. How did I end up stressing about money management all day? Well, I just need to put those thoughts aside and focus on the children. Their safety is the most important thing. And it's not just because a lawsuit would bankrupt us right now. That casino mission would be good experience for them. But it's too risky. What if I let them go and the worst happens? <sighs> Need to focus. Only one unfathomable fear at a time, Forsyth. If Hollis associated risk with something more positive than death, it would open her up to so many more missions. I mean, life experiences. Feels like I got a little more spring in my levitation. I know it's only for emergencies, but I really nothing like a little clairvoyance booster shot. If I'm at the shore, it's fun to take risks. But what use is it? No. Whenever I see socks with sandals, it reminds me of my favorite jerk. What if my husband starts wearing socks with sandals? Oh I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If Hollis wants to solve her money problems, she's gonna need to accept some risks. Mushrooms really do add a savory heft to any dish. Mm. That's not the change I was going for. No. Whenever I see socks with sandals, it reminds me of my favorite German college professor. The great part about having fun is that all the most fun activities... I should really use soap when cleaning my produce, especially the cilantro. It's the only way to kill germs. I know cilantro reduces the risk of digestive distress, but it tastes like soap. And honestly, I'd rather have the gas. Interesting. But that's not going to help us go on that casino. I don't want to bug her in her quiet place, especially when she's pondering big ideas like death and money and stuff. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. Who am I kidding? 
If I wasn't worried about something, I wouldn't be me. It just means I care. I think the only way to get Hall is to take us on a mission to a casino is to get her to associate risk with money. I should really do something. I know cilantro reduces the risk of digestive distress, but it tastes like soap. I can't believe some people prefer open casket funerals. Yes, if I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. I definitely could not handle that stressful line. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If the Psychonauts don't get some more funding soon, I'm... Well, I'm going to die. That's all there is to it. Yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. Sure, it's fun to take risks. But what use is it? No. Whenever I see socks with sandals, it reminds me of my favorite German college professor. If I could just get Hollis to be less risk-averse. What if my husband starts wearing sunglasses? I just remembered how dire the psycho. If the psychonauts don't get some yes, if I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. about money so much. It is the root of all evil, after all. I know cilantro reduces the risk of digestive distress, but it tastes like so I should really use soap when cleaning my produce, especially the cilantro. It's the only way to kill germs. Yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely sure it's fun to take risks. But what you mean? Mushrooms really do add a savory heft to any dish. Mushrooms? Really? Who am I kidding? If I wasn't worried about something, I wouldn't be me. Oh my. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. <laughs> if the Psychonauts don't get some more yes. if I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If the Psychonauts don't get some more funding soon, I'm... Well, I'm going to die. That's all there is to it. But what yes? If I let those children go on yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. Sure, it's fun to take risks. But what use is it? But what use is it? No. Whenever I see socks with sandals, it reminds me of my favorite shirt. What if my husband starts wearing socks with sandals? Could I still love him? Oh my. I 
just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. I just remembered how dire... I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. Yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. If the Psychonauts don't get some more funding soon, I'm... Well, I'm going to die. That's all there is to it. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. I definitely could not handle that. Yes. If I let those children go on yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. thinking about money so much. It is the root of all evil, after all. should really use soap when cleaning my produce, especially the cilantro. It's the only way to kill germs. When you pick up wild mushrooms, you really need to clean them thoroughly before cooking. Mushrooms really do add a savory heft to any dish. Sure, it's fun to take risks. But what use is it? If there was a way to connect money and risk, I'm sure that would solve our problems, and nothing bad would happen. I don't want to bug her in her quiet place, especially when she's pondering big ideas like death and money and stuff. Socks with sandals. It reminds me of my favorite German college professor. What if my husband starts wearing socks with sandals? Oh my. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If the Psychonauts don't get some more funding soon, yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. Oh my. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. I just remembered how I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. I think the only way to get Hollis to take us on a mission to a casino is to get her to associate risk with money. Yes, if I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. You're just trying to get locked up in psycho-isolation, aren't you? Mushrooms really do add a savory heft to any dish. No. Whenever I see socks with sandals, it reminds me of my favorite German college professor. What if my husband starts wearing socks with sandals? Could I still love him? Oh my. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. Oh my. I 
just for you. I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. I definitely could not handle that stressful mission. I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. If the Psychonauts don't get some... Yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. There was a way to connect money and risk. I'm sure that would solve our problems, and nothing bad would happen. Sure, it's fun to take risks. But what use is it? If there was a way to connect money and risk, I'm sure that would solve our problems, and nothing bad would happen. If the Psychonauts don't get some more funding soon, I'm... Yes. If I let those children go on that... Yes. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. If there was a way to connect money with risk, I'm sure that would solve our problems, and nothing bad would happen. I definitely could not handle it. I just remembered who I I just remembered how dire the Psychonauts' finances are. I definitely could not handle that stressful casino mission right now. If there was a way to connect money and risk, I'm sure that would solve our problems, and nothing bad would happen. If I let those children go on that mission, they would surely die. If there was a way to connect money and risk, I'm sure that would solve problems, and nothing bad would happen. just figured out how to solve all our money problems.
Hey, Teach, what gives? I was in the middle of a sweet hookup there. Guess what, kids? You all did so well on your lesson. How about we give your new power a test drive out in the field? You mean we're going on the mission? For real? Isn't that dangerous? You know what they say, Sam. Nothing ventured, nothing brained. I don't think that's what... Let's roll. Heck yes! Cool. All right. Sweet. Um... Woo! I'm so glad you changed your mind about the mission, Agent Forsyth. I was nervous about bringing the children, but if you feel that it's safe, then it must be. It's crucial we find out what these delusionists are up to at the casino. With you handling tactical command, I'd say our probability of mission success has risen 35%. I'll take those odds. Now how long till we reach the Lady Lactopus? We are almost there. Agent Forsyth, how are you feeling? <laughs> Lucky. Well, we're here. Using a false identity, we've secured a high roller suite to use as our base of operations. Now, children, you are not to leave the suite. Like most casinos, the Lady Lactopus has a strict no psychics policy. Weak. Be happy for this chance to observe Agent Forsyth in action. Teacup, this is Shoehorn. We are nearing position one. I'm moving down the primary ventilation shaft, and Dustpan is approaching the front desk. Teacup, come in. Are you there? Hollis. Hmm? Oh, yes. Shoehorn, this is Teacup. I have you on visual. Teacup, this is Dustpan. I'm approaching position one. After you've disabled the side detectors and inhibitors, on your go-ahead, I'll approach the reception desk and distract the clerks. After they're distracted, I'll drop into the office and find the room number that belongs to this key. Just make sure to disable the main fan, because my position is close... No need to explain, agents. You do your job, and I'll do mine. Let's keep radio silent so I can concentrate. Understood. Roger that, teacup. Dustpan out. <laughs> 